Hello, Bumpy McSquigums here, and it's time to continue with my Let's Play of XCOM Long War. This is episode 93, and we are continuing with a few things. First off, I know who I want to promote. I have figured it out. And it is another gunner, ladies and gentlemen. I know, I know. Mr. Updown66 will never be a psionic person anyway. Because I feel it is more important for him to shoot stuff. So we're going to do that. Um, in addition, we're going to scan until he returned... And I guess that's fine. We'll, we'll roll with that. So, let's go here and... Actually, let's go back to briefing. What do we... Oh, okay. Research. Uh, so we should have our two new weapons, if I'm not mistaken. Alright, fine, fine, no, no, fine, yes, yes, no. Alright, I want a medic. And I think our only medic is one of the lower end medics. There we go. So, time for him to shine and come up in this world. I want a secondary gunner. Isn't John Smith the gunner available? Yes. Okay. And you know what? I do all this, and there's one other thing I wanted to do before I did that. Folks, I want to go into the barracks. I want... not barracks. The... I want to augment the soldier. And the soldier I wanted to augment was... Commander J said he wants to be... You guessed it. Chopped up into little bits. A chop here, a chop there... And soon enough, we'll have a soldier un... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nobody cares, Dr. Shen. Nobody cares. Alright, so let's start this over again. No, no. Yes, no. Alright, we'll throw our medic actually at the end here. Medic. Um, we will throw... Our secondary gunner. John Smith. John Smith. There we go. Into the mix. We have a sniper, a medic, a double gunner, and infantry... Scout, we need an assault class. Um, commissar it is. Alright, there we go. Let's make items available. And let's edit this and load them out and get moving. Alright, folks. So, lots of stuff going on. Lots of bad weather. I mean, just horrible, horrible, awful stuff to prevent me from doing anything. But, that is neither here nor there. I am here now. I am eager, I am ready, and I am going to do some murder. All right, and I think we can throw an arc thrower up there in case we see one of our nemesises, our nemesi that we have not captured yet. I might also try capturing a muton. I don't know if I've done that yet, and even if I haven't, they're the ones with the alien grenades. We already t uh, researched the tech in the foundry for alien grenades, but I don't think we ever captured an alien that actually had a grenade, so... That could prove to be somewhat problematic, as I'm sure you could imagine. So, a Muton or a Sectoid Commander, I think, are the two that we still need to capture. I don't know if we need to capture any others. I don't believe so. Alright, you get the Gauss, the Alloy Abapod, and that. I'm going to go with you. I think you're already set up. Just fine, you are... Okay, you're probably set, but I think you need to switch your... Yeah, you do. You need to switch your weapon to the Gatling Pulsar. Alright, so there's our new amazing weaponry that we have that makes us look amazing and super powerful. Also notice this no longer seems to lower your movement. And I haven't updated my Long War mod, so I don't know why that has changed. I could have sworn it used to. Perhaps I'm crazy and wrong, but I don't think so. I mean, I am crazy. Let's let's be real. Oh, hold on. Let's get that. Yeah, we'll throw that into the mix. And then we're going to do a scope and then a battle scanner, which also means, if I'm not mistaken, our medic here can also rock the Gauss. So he's actually going to be slightly more viable than normal as a DPS here, which is pretty cool, I got this to say. Though his aim's gonna be pretty abysmal, if I'm not mistaken. But we'll see. Alright, I think our group is actually fairly powerful right now. Yeah, his aim is bad at 71%, but eh, it is simply what it is. Alright, folks, let's get this mission underway and see what's up. Let us see what's up. On the mission site. We shall begin the assault and forever be amazing. Border. Picked up a local so, broadcast. Let's picked up a local broadcast. Blah blah blah. Nobody cares. Today. Launch mission. Let's go. And we are here. Ooh. I like this map. Sort of. Strike one is a waiting drop clearance. 
Let me rephrase that. I sometimes like this map. One is cleared to engage hostile targets. What do we see there, with Le Willy? Apparently a lot of nothing. Alright, that's okay. I don't necessarily mind that. Um, what if we send Logan McVeigh up slowly? Take a look around. We see nothing. <gasps> okay. Well, that didn't end in disaster. That makes me actually significantly more happy than you might consider. I'm going to move up here and hope that the one step to the right doesn't ruin things. Oh, it did not. All right. So if you guys have never heard of the darkest, or sorry, of darkest dungeon, there's no the. It's just darkest dungeon. TM? No. Um, yeah, it's a fun, fun roguelike game. It's something that I have just started up coverage of on the channel. It's gonna take a back seat kind of. I'm gonna do two the two episodes this week, maybe three, and then I'm going to bang out the rest of Risen One, which I think I might throw in as a daily episode just to get it through and then there's gonna be a break before I start Risen 2 and in which time I'm going to focus on some others uh, I put up another episode of hell we've started the new uh, campaign the I guess the final campaign of the game where you control the demons now after controlling the humans originally so there is that and there's no telling what's next for me uh, Risen 3 will still continue to be done Wasteland 2 I'm gonna focus on probably in the interim between uh, Risen 1 and 2 and also of course Lords of Shulama I put a put um, what is it called uh, Legend of Grimrock 2 on the back burner for a while simply because it's a game I need to really carve out some time to get done way. so it's possible I might force that to the forefront instead of Wasteland 2 though I'm not sure I'm not 100% certain I'm actually gonna move Sani El Sanu over here which may be a mistake nope it's okay all right, Overwatch, the one individual who can, and then we will move onward and see what's next. The aliens are moving around, though I don't see or hear any of them at this moment. Uh, Commissar, I suppose, can move up here. Yeah, wow, we're seeing like literally nothing going on. Man, what is up? I'm like, I don't know where to stick a few of these folks, because I don't know what's coming down the, the pipeline toward us here. I don't want to move her maybe into a position where she can run out and just massacre people. I'm not sure, though. I don't, again, I, I don't know. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do! Sunny El Sanu can okay. move along the lines here. Probably. Um, since I am overwatching, I don't want to go too far forward yet. Move into position. There we go, and I think he's the last individual to move. Nope. We have Raven McVeigh there. Alright, we'll end our turn. If any aliens decide they want to patrol the front of the gas station, they're going to pay for it. Okay. Well, we shall move our walking frontliner to, you guessed it, the front line. Ah, squids. Great. Come forward, for we do not fear you. Or do we? Well, I'm going to kill you, so that's that's kind of one of those things that's just going to be happening right now. Can't say I minds that too, too much. I'm going to move over here. Again, hoping that nothing's in our line of sight. There it is. Oh, he's going to go onto the roof? Sure, why not? Eh thing hits me, it hits me, it's fine. I think it's going to be more important for me to scan this area over here. Eyes open. Because that should reveal the remaining three squids coming at us. It did not. It revealed one. Huh. Which actually concerns me way more than you might consider. Alright, 66%. So a fairly good shot. Oh, did some damage to it, too. I figured we would probably be able to kill him, but wasn't sure. Eh, might as well take a one and three shot. Nope. No such luck. Shot so be it. Not gonna shoot him. 100%. 80%. Let's go for the 80. I know, the 100%'s guaranteed, but uh, 80%'s pretty good odds. Right through the window. Commissar is ready. Um, 
can't capture this one. Well, I'm gonna move around the corner here and just blast him in the face, I suppose. Not much more to say about it than that. Um, I think I might move Guy Furion forward, and I'm gonna try to battle scanning maybe over a little further. Let's have a peek. Maybe I was a bit hopeful with what I was doing before. All right, where did they go? Huh. Well, take him down. Wow, that thing did work. How much damage? Ten on a non-crit. That is pretty impressive. All right, I'm sure he's gonna shoot at one of us. No? This is gonna walk us down, huh? They got me flanked. So we're flanked, and we have the squids that can come and do whatever they want to us at this point. Assuming they came forward, we're not 100% guaranteed that they actually... There they are. I guess he's gonna shoot? Yeah, he did. Shouldn't we have seen him, though? Like, before he got to that point? Wow. Go. Go medic, man. Go. Uh, some weird stuff going on. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Eh, we'll take the shot again. And if we get lucky, we hit him. If nothing else, we put hollow targeting on him, right? So, I mean, there is something to be said about this. Uh, 90%. 60. I think I'm gonna go for the 90. Let's eliminate him immediately. Down he goes. Um... Don't have a great shot with you, but... 42%? Eh, I'll take the shot. Might actually hit it. I'll try it again. Missed. Nope. There was a pretty good chance that we would have hit that, but I guess... I was being too hopeful. What do you guys? I'm gonna see what the rest of my folks can do before I move too far forward that way. Oops, 100%, 47, so we'll save it. Um, what do you have? You have a shot on all of these guys. And you should have... Oh, you don't. You only have a shot on the two. Alright, well, we'll do the 91 first. Completely annihilate him. Goodbye. Good day, sir. And a double tap is up, and 79% to follow. And that is definitely a good day. Guy Furion. Eh... I suppose we'll move here. We'll overwatch. 47%. Who knows, maybe we get lucky on this one. Nope. Totally missed. Ask me if I'm surprised. The answer. Nope. Not even sort of. Something about hit some instant set about everything. Okay. We'll go here. Something about Lugar. It's totally fine. Alright, come on. Show me both of them. There it is. Alright. So they're both going to be behind the cover of uh, the cloud. And it should be good. And I suppose Commissar has some maneuvers he can do. Hopefully not triggering any more enemies to come murder us. And it does not appear that that is the case. Or it does appear that he didn't trigger... I, I don't know. However you'd like to word it, it's fine. I need to fidget in my chair just a bit. He should retreat, in theory. I mean, all of his brethren are dead at this point. So, I don't know. He doesn't That's seem right. to really do much at all, to be honest. That's affirmative. All right, going to move here and reload. Ready to rock. Going to take the long shot. 60%. Raven says, what? Get wrecked. Erledigt. And there it there. is. Um, we'll move up here with Commissar and reload. Maybe we won't reload. How far is he gonna come? No, I don't think reloading is a viable option at this point. How far can we shoot? Not far enough. Alright, well, let's move here then. Or I say, they were overwatching, weren't they? Crap. Oh, they missed them. Well, then I feel quite a bit better about that. There's, wow, there's actually four of them? I thought there was only three. Okay, one, two, three, and then the big guy. We should have enough firepower to take this guy out. In theory, we'll see, though. 
All right, he's gonna go rawr, and we're gonna be like, oh no, and he's gonna be like, close combat specialist, go. And he did some work there. It wasn't a tremendously huge amount of work, but it was some work. And I think Commissar... Oh, he's still got another shot. Nice, let's take it. And now he's totally out of bullets, but I think that's more than fine. Especially considering she just freaked out and crapped herself. Perfect. Um, you don't have a shot because I already moved you. You will have a shot. You only have one shot, but you should be able to reload after the fact. But you missed because you're awful. Need a resupply. Good job. We're green to go. Damn it. Somehow you have no shot, which is also equally awesome. Um, gonna be a little risky here. I'm gonna go over to this side. Hopefully, it's a decent enough shot that we can hit him. Nope. Not even sort of. Alright, we have no bullets left. We have no vision there. Oh, this sucks. This might actually end up getting us killed. Heading there now. Oh, we have a 98% chance to get him closer. Should have done this for Oh, but he ran away, not closer. How does he not have mm. Well, I don't know exactly what his plan's gonna be. I hope he hits... Yeah, I hope he hits Slay Willy here. Wow, that was actually more damage than I thought it was going to be. And then, her being exposed like she is. That was a weird maneuver. Uh, okay. Uh-oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, what are we looking at here? An 80% on this. That's impressive, actually. And we still missed it because we're awesome. Raven's got a reload. Not fantastic for us in any way. Alright, looks like we're gonna overwatch. Guy Furion. Uh, I suppose we can move up here, hopefully triggering overwatch. We did not. Crap, okay. Right, we'll take that shot. Move him closer to us. Commissar has pooped himself, which is fantastic for everyone involved, I'm sure. Um, what if I move back here? We're going to get shot because we're being overwatched. Hopefully it doesn't hit. It might. It shouldn't kill us even if it does hit. Good, it did not. Sweet. Over here, I can't use my fire because I will melt my ally and my teammate here. Let's see, Sani El Sanu, can you not miss this time? There it is! Third time's a charm, I suppose. Third time is the charm. Alright, well, we can move by the truck now and throw a heal. Which, while not amazing, is still not horrible. Lay like, Willie's probably going to be sidelined for a little bit, but eh, you know, it's 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 okay. It's not like I said, it's not the end of the world. All right, and I think that's about it. No, not quite. She can reload. That is going to be it. So we'll say there's going to be some overwatching going on and some shooting. I'm sure. Yeah, I knew Guy Furion was in a bad position, but I assume maybe we can get out of it. Does not appear to be so. Alright. Like some more bad Juju McGumbo. Oh my goodness. Some more bad Juju McGumbo is going on. Um, let's take the shot at this guy. He might start repairing, but... We are just unfortunately unlucky with this. Alright, taking the crit hit at 80%, and we hit, did not crit, that's unfortunate. Commissar needs to reload. For whatever reason, he cannot hit anything, and I just, I don't understand. So we're gonna hop down and reload him. And in the future, hopefully he can actually shoot some stuff. Guy Furion can and will fall back. I'm rolling. Some lightning reflexes for us. Never gonna hit me. 
Okay, reload. Um, going to maneuver you into a different position as well, but to do so would require too much commitment. So what I think I'm going to do is, can I reload and overwatch? I cannot. 67%, might as well take that shot, and boom, nailed it too. Very nicely done. Very nicely done. Wouldn't Say, mind you sending story. you into doing some uh, damage, like flamethrower action, over to the left, but we really, really need to trigger a lot of overwatch for that to actually be viable. So, I'm gonna reload, maybe. What do you want? You know what? Let's take that shot. Maybe we hit it. Oh, no such luck. Commissar is no longer freaked out. Oh, this guy's gonna pop up on our, uh, our flank here. X-ray on the move! They're flanking us! An overwatch. This guy is closing the distance with our people. Get me the hell out of here! Oh, suppressed. Okay, we have to handle that first. Okay, good to know. These strategies are forming. Another high ground overwatch. And a shot? Mildly annoying. Not that big of an issue. And, uh, another one? Ooh, two. Okay. Well, we can repair that again in one shot with our medic. Will our gunner actually land the shot this time? Only time will tell. Nope. Missed every single shot thrown so far. Mildly impressive to be uh, that bad at shooting. I'm gonna sit here and hope to hit. And I was hoping for, like, a little, a little tiny bit more damage, but I suppose that did stop this guy. I'm gonna go out I'm wide rolling. here. Gonna hope that we don't trigger an overwatch. We did not. Now, can you actually be a hero and finish him? Nope, you cannot at all be a hero and finish anyone. Shot wide. All right. Well, we have an overwatch. I am actually very curious to what we can have done here. Guy Furion can definitely move over here. On the move. Triggering Overwatch? No. Overwatch triggered. Interesting. 100% shot, and not enough again. This guy is super duper tanky. Alright, kind of wish I could get closer, but that's not in the cards right now. So what we'll do is throw a heal. <sighs> do we have vision of anyone? We do, but we're going to have to do that. Commissar can move there, but I, I don't feel like that's the best spot. We're going to try to take a run over here. Oh, we avoided the overwatch. Excellent. 97% and down he goes. Good job, Commissar. Alright, what do we have? Let's go for that guy. We actually go for all of them. But, oh, Alright, beautifully done. One down. And second shot at 54%. Might as well take that too. Bam. Get wrecked. So at this point, my biggest concern is probably this dude over here. 67%? Um, might as well take that shot too. Probably gonna miss, but you never know. We hit the 54, right? Alright, so it's this guy's turn to do annoying bad stuff to us. Probably gonna hit... That's not who I thought you were gonna shoot at. I'm actually glad that you decided to go for him, because that is a very, very long shot. So it's this one, that one, and then one over here, I think. And then we'll be done. Oh, where did that guy come from? Alright, buddy. Get to try again. 80%. Oh my gosh. A oh, superhero. Finally. Not not really. Not really a superhero, but it could be. Alright, Logan Raven McVeigh is like... Boom. Get wrecked. Alright, what? Really? You decided to just, like, float right on top of us? That seems like a very silly idea. How do you not have vision of that? Ooh, I'm like super duper laggy right now. 90% and not quite enough to finish you off. That is somewhat troubling. We'll move over here. And can Sani El Sanu make up for all the misses in the past? She can, and she did. He's dead. And that means that it's only the individual here left? 
I think that's actually accurate, so... I'm gonna move over. Probably gonna get Overwatch shot at. Uh, you know, 67%? I'll take that shot when I... Boom! Oh, 8 damage. Now the question begins. Can Congo get the kill? I don't think so. We can't Overwatch though. And we will. Mr. Updown 66. You know what? We'll overwatch with you as well. It is your move, good sir. What are you going to do with it? I think that you, in fact, are going to die with it. Oh, we have no bullets. Well, that's unfortunate. Alright. Guy Furion, you know your role. Expend that overwatch shot, buddy. Expend that overwatch shot. Beautifully done. Running up and stopping right there. Sunny El Sanu is going to go move. for a shot. I don't think it's going to have vision. Nope. Got Overwatch. No bullets on him. We're going to take the shot with Congo. 41% and boom. Destroyed. Another day, another successful operation. Woot woot. There you go. Another day, another successful operation. Pretty sure Le Willy is going to be sidelined for a little... I don't think it's going to be a long time, but it might be. It's hard to tell, because they have so much health. There's no telling how much damage was actually done. We'll see here in just a moment. Only five days. Okay, Guy Furion. And... Uh, Le Willy didn't even... It didn't break through the armor. Alright, well there we go. Sweet. So that is actually exceptionally good. I don't know why he's even wounded, because he had the better armor on, which... It, which stopped five damage. He only got hit for five at any point, if I'm not mistaken. Not sure why he's there, but it doesn't really matter in the end, because if you take a look at the overall statistics or whatever, everybody's fatigued for five days anyway, so... Being wounded for five? Not that bad. And Commissar earned a promotion to Sergeant, which is sweet, sweet, nice. Uh, nope. Yep. And confirmed. There we go, folks. So, another successful mission. We are victorious... Sectoid corpses, floater corpses, berserker corpse, and meld. We didn't really get to the stuff, but we got decent stuff all around. And of course, the Seeker Rex. 115 we will monies. Be in touch, Commander. All in all, not too bad. We're gonna hopefully trigger the advanced pulse lasers and start the next thing. Ooh, the UFO has bombed civilian targets in the United Kingdom. Not great. Hey, we're waging Wordy is back, as is Lance Elliott. Excellent. And feel free to pause and read that very, very long thing there. The Scatter Blaster, available. The Pulse Sniper Rifle, available. The Pulse Lance, the Blaster Rifle, the Heavy Pulse Rifle, and the Super Capacitors Project are all available. Which is nice, I think. Alright, here we go. Let's read it. The Shotgun Equivalent Weapon Deploying Pulse Laser Technology. So, woohoo! Next level. Skipping the Gauss completely. And we have the Super Capacitors. By increasing our ability to burst energy through our aircraft laser cannon optics, we can make these weapons far more dangerous to our alien foe by increasing their firing rate and armor-piercing capabilities. Sounds good. Uh, the heavy pulse rifle, a more powerful version. Uh, the blaster rifle, a medium-range pulse rifle usable by our scouts and snipers. Nice. The pulse lance. A, ooh, for our mech. Nice. Another upgrade there. Pulse sniper rifle, of course. So that is going to be exceptionally amazing. Alright, and there's a UFO analysis for the destroyer that we haven't done yet. Which apparently is only a one day deal, so we will do that one. Then there's the power armor, which I think is going to be amazing. Um, alien power systems, probably not. We'll do the autops. Ooh, that's a long one. Um, I'm not sure. I'm, I don't know what I'll do after that, but we're definitely going to do the destroyer. And maybe the mobile armor. I armors. appreciate your efforts to support the research team, So with that, Commander. folks... I've already put the new we are going to go to engineering, and we're going to see what it takes to build one of these new sniper rifles, I think. Let's see, what was it called? Wasn't it a pulse sniper rifle or something? It is, and it's 208. I think we can make that happen. What is the pulse auto blaster? What is that? A rapid fire version of the pulse minus one mobility. Increased critical chance, equipable by gunners only. Oh, well, we, we already have the better version of that, don't we? Uh, enhanced beam optics. Okay, so... I think what we'll do is... 
We're gonna go get one of the sniper rifles being built. We're gonna go to the gray market. I'm sure we have enough stuff that we can sell something to make it a viable option. And we have quite a few secret wrecks, so why don't we sell... I don't know, like 30... There we go, $36 worth, so 12 of them. We'll complete the transaction, and then we're going to go back to mission control. No, back to engineering. Building, and we're going to go down to the bottom, and... The Pulse sniper rifle is there. We manufacture it, and done. So, our singular sniper, which is usually all that we bring, anyway, is going to be a very, very happy in 10 days' time. And that's pretty much going to do it for this episode, folks. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, well, stick around on the channel and tomorrow you'll actually see the next episode in theory unless I somehow I'm unable to upload once again but either way that's gonna do it for this episode I will see you guys tomorrow in theory with the next episode of XCOM Long War until then my name is Bumpy McSquiggums and I will see you later